Hello guys, welcome back. This is Kay Hayes for After Effects Tutorial Channel. And now we're working with 3D camera tracking on live action footage. Create a new project, double click, import your video, and drop in new composition. Train from 5 seconds and go to 15 seconds go to composition menu and select trim comp to work area finish select your video right click pre-compose move all attributes name it footage press enter so now select your layer and go to workspace motion tracking track camera and wait after solving camera wait there is a dots the video is track it and then select the dot which you want to create your 3d object over there like this select this point right click create null and camera and now right click create a new solid name it old house press enter and go to effects video copilot select element 3d and then go to effect control scene setup and import your 3d model there is the model select it and open open there is a 3D model and turn off the lights, the ground. I need just this home alone. Select and move up. What about textures? Select your object layer, texture and go to texture, diffuse, load texture, desktop there is the texture and press ok zoom in this is the old house with model and then press ok ok now there is the model of house go to group 1 particle look change the size and then open replicator and there is the position x y and z select the null object press p copy the null object position one go to group one element 3d paste here copy another one copy paste here and copy paste here there is the house and select the old house layer go to element 3d change the size up okay and now go to rotation press ctrl slowly rotate and move the house there and rotate go to render setting and lighting select cinema select basic or Additional lighting, rotation. You can create the HDRI reflection, the footage background. Go to environment, select, go to desktop, select the picture of scene. And now time to create the shadow go to scene setup and then 
create a plan move little bit up great and now move the plan into group 2 select the plan and go to turn on the match shadow option press ok close the group 1 close the render setting lighting and go to ambient occlusion turn on there is the lighting and the shadow go to group 2 particle replicator control Z go back to scene setup and then select the plan and scale up the plan press ok go back scene setup change the color first set the plan under the house model like this rotation go back to scene setup and select go to setting turn on again the match shadow press ok and go back to ambient occlusion change the quality 64 change the intensity and go back again to group 2 good change the quality more 128 and intensity like this test your video looking not bad okay select again the house and then move the house go to group one looking good right click create uh, adjustment layer and then uh, go to workspace select the facts and let's color grading right here um, color balance select drop here and go to blue change blue five 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 First, drop another effect, Xenion, Converter, press Control, good, select again and go to another effects, Curves, select again and right here tent drop tent on old house set 30 or 35 
no 25 good and now right click create a black solid for creating school frame turn off control R and turn on title action save area create a guideline select the layer scope draw from there mask it then subtract and turn on this is the scope okay now render again before rendering select the old house and go to motion blur turn on the motion blur and press render again close close and wait okay guys thank you for watching this is the video about uh, 3d camera tracking and this is the empty footage there is nothing but created by element 3d like this Thank you for watching. Don't forget like and subscribe the channel. See you next time.